So I couldn't leave it well enough alone. I really, really, really want this to work and so that I can have the skin quality of um, metahumans as uh, with my actual characters who all have to look alike. Now, I accidentally screwed up the audio when I was screen recording this next process. What I am doing is exporting the uh, normal maps into Affinity Photo and then lining up, tying in on the uh, left normal map with the MetaHumans normal map, uh, which is about as much fun as it sounds because they are, um, you know, spread across the mesh differently. Um, so I, since I deleted the original audio, what I did was I went ahead and sped up, did a time lapse of these, uh, this next process. Um, but if you actually want to see what I'm doing, you can, um, of course, slow it down. I got a solution that I didn't completely hate. As we'll see here when he gets toward the end, he looks a lot closer. So I actually had relatively good luck with the normal maps. I did not have as good a luck when I tried to add Tynan's face diffuse, his underlying albedo or diffuse, whatever you want to call it, uh, to the uh, to the metahumans. That turned out to be much, much harder. Um, so I did not, um, I, I wasn't as successful at that. He's getting there. So, um, so in this case, when it came to the normal map, I was relatively successful at getting them lined up, despite the fact that they are not laid out the same. Uh, but see, he looks better.